the first day was I was full of uh, colonized mentality or my mind was very passive. I had the colonial mentality, colonial settings. We blame the government, we blame the we blame the West for what happened to the Umma. But after the training, through the series of workshops and lectures and challenging notes, uh, thoughts that were given to us, I feel that we can do better in, in working, inshallah. And this doing better would gradually impact in the Bangsa Moro. So my baggage when I came here is it's more on very political. Uh, but here we were taught on uh, to play in a different role, particularly how are we going to negotiate uh, in, 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 for example, in, in the business context. So when we negotiate in the business context, in the workshop, my thinking was more political. So that's why we were sitting there and our aim is to manipulate and to defeat, defeat our, uh, our uh, colleagues who are in the different um, settings. And unfortunately, we didn't come with, the, we failed to come with the wise agreement, which uh, is not a, a, which is a challenging experience uh, to, to, to us. Uh, the trainers are very good. Um, compared to other trainings that we were in, for, uh, particularly those organized by uh, Western funding donors, Western institutions, um, their standards are low. Sometimes they didn't pose as challenge. No? Um, sometimes they had, uh, from international context, they lowered it in, in our context, which affect the, the, um, the learning process of the, the participants. These are the trainings that we had here. But in this training, uh, mashallah, alhamdulillah, the, the methodology is different. The standard is international. So they didn't lower the standards. Now it is, it is our obligations to, to adjust in that standards so that the quality of the training wouldn't be sacrificed. This program is totally different from the other trainings that I have attended. Because this type of program is very intensive, I think I have now the confidence to go out there and share what, I, what I've learned in this program. So uh, it added my confidence, my, um, my um, tr trust to myself, and then um, I can 100% say that I have something to give for my Bangsamoro people. The, the mechanisms, as I've observed, the mechanisms that the facilitators and the trainers use, they uh, give the situation first. Uh, they let the participants experience the situation first before giving the inputs. So the participants, uh, you know, experience is the best teacher and then you, the moment you experience that mistake, you'll be able to forget it for the rest of your life. So that's why I guarantee that, that's why I guarantee that you won't forget it for the rest of your life because it's an actual experience. And um, compared to just lecturing there, saying this and that, it's, it's so boring. But this program is something totally different from the previous, previous trainings that I have attended. In the first day, I think I feel like I, I didn't, uh, I don't have the right leadership capacities and capabilities. I, I think, uh, I think of myself as like uh, a little one who who needs to learn a lot and who who needs to to extract some information for me to become a leader. Having those four days, Alhamdulillah, uh, I'm I'm not saying that I am capable, I'm more capable now, but I can say that I am privileged enough to to be one of the participants. Uh, I am happy because I can share something for my organization and I know I can contribute something in my own little ways through this program. After the four-day training, there was a lot of learnings for me personally. I learned that I can look into the eyes of the person, that I can uh, speak in front of the crowd, that I can decide uh, whenever things need to be decided and uh, lots of knowledge were uh, contributed or shared to us. I think this kind of program would really help the Bangsamoro youth 
because this uh, this kind of program, the training are really amazing. The trainers are are very good. That the trainers are really pushing us to to do better jobs, to think harder, to think critically, and it really uh, personally it really opened my mind that I should I should be reading more. I should be engaging more, and I think if if this kind of trainings would be done to more of the Bangsamoro youth, it would really help us.